and welcome to Joyce's Application Questions, or JAX. I'm Mark Burleson, a Senior Application Engineer with Joyce Dayton. Today I will be showing you how to remove a ball nut from screw using a mandrel. Sitting in front of me here is a two-ton reverse base keyed for traveling nut ball screw jack with a servo motor mount. First step is to take an Allen wrench and remove the stop if there is one present on the screw. If there are fine threads here, use some masking tape to cover up the threads. Take the mandrel and put it on top of the screw, ensuring that it is flush with the masking tape. Next, take your ball nut, holding the mandrel, and rotate it up onto the mandrel. Next, remove the mandrel, ensuring that it stays firmly in place inside the ball nut. If you remove the mandrel, all the balls will fall out of the ball nut. To put the ball nut back on, simply repeat the procedure. Note that the flange can be either installed flange down or flange up. That's all there is to it. For more information, please visit joystain.com or contact an application engineer.